Hello. Hello, Grant's back. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Mass... Let's play Mass Effect 2. Here we are, still on Tachanka. Uh, I'm wondering, do we have any little side things here before we head off? Uh... Tally and Garrus both have personal matters they wish to discuss. Let's do that when we get back up there. Uh, old blood... Oh, we've got to tell the chief uh, scout that the scout's come headed back. And we have this manifold that we should... Okay. We do have things still to do here on Tachanka, so let's do those before we head off. Because otherwise I will forget. Um, I will forget if I don't do this now, so let's... Hear that, Morden? has increased in strength after the destruction of Clan Werelock. Based on population profiles, Clan Erdnot has adopted surviving members of Clan Werelock, mostly women and children. Ah, intelligent move. Surprising from Krogan. Glad to see it. Ah, Rex is a good guy. Right. We need to talk to... Oh, it's a gambling station for something. Let's talk to the chief scout. Okay. My scout made it back. We've got him at the tent. Doesn't remember much beyond getting tortured, but he remembers you. Said you yelled at him until he got his hump out of that basin back here. You've got a quad, human. Thanks for saving my scout. <laughs> Saves me having to train another one. Okay. Uh, what's the need for scouting then? You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Varen here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol. Keep them honest. Hmm. Okay. Um, what's your duties as the chief scout? What does the scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. He's a scout! Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide and seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers. Hardly sounds like scouting. I can see elements of it, so and, and all of this is normal. So every clan of Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined <laughs> by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. True. Doesn't really sound like scouting, though. That's not recon, that's sabotage. Still scouting. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. <laughs> Everyone knows where Erdnot is, human. It's not like we can hide. Okay. Uh, threats to food. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. Mm. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that... Our women and children get the security. No, uh, because we the genophage, they'll be important, won't they? Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, a clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire on non-combatants. Hmm. Okay. I don't want to say not the best solution. Cause, um, what would that be referenced to? Um, I don't know. We're going after the women and children, maybe? Taking care of your food supply would help more in the long run. Okay. If Clan Jordan kills our guards and helps itself to our well-secured food, there won't be a long term. This is Tachanka. Having power and clean water means we're living in luxury. All right. Fair enough. Thanks for the information. Don't know about the rest of your species, but you're good in my books, human. Yep. Give me a reason. <laughs> Don't tempt me, because I might do. Step back. You killed that Thresher Maw on foot? Yep. Welcome to the clan, or not grunt. Honored to be a part of it. Good for you. Now go find something <laughs> else to do. Those oh, it's... brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the. Ah uh ha -huh. ha! You tell me, how can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? Mm -hmm. uh, who are you? I've never seen a broken mechanic before. What? 
You think we kidnap quarians and make them do the hard work? Not anymore, we don't. <laughs> oh dear. I should have brought Tally. That's like the second time quarians have been picked on in this uh, in, um, on Tachanka. Oh, but I, I found a combustion manifold. I found a combustion manifold out in the field. Is this what you need? That'll work. Faster than building one from scratch, at least. You just saved me three days' work, human. You've earned my time if you want it. What do you think of Rex? How do you feel about what Rex is trying to do? The old man's crazy, if you ask me. Which you just did. I did. But that stuff fixes itself. If it doesn't work, Rex gets torn to shreds and we find out who's got the next best plan. Okay. Uh, what are you doing? What's that you're working on there? I'm tuning up these machines for battle. It's a wonder this Tomka here made it back to camp. It could be worse. A couple more hits on the broadside, and this thing would have crumbled. Sounds... It seems odd to find a Krogan mechanic. Why are you one? Krogan plays so much importance on martial strength. How did you become a mechanic? How do you think those fools make it to the field to kill each other? Who do you think keeps the weapons working? Without me, there's no battle. Just slaughter. I am the military might of Clan Urgnaught. He's... I think he's thinking kind of feudalism and knights running out. He's the blacksmith, isn't he? Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. <laughs> General updated. Do this thing. We've already done it. Krogan's hit by genophage. Nuclear assaults. Civil wars. Still survive. Yeah, no thanks to you. Or anyone else. Impressive to see life adapt, continue despite circumstances. Inspiring. Oh, right, these are Pyjets. Okay. Let's uh, talk to Fortak. As I understand it, Clan Erdnot has a new member. So, you're our new warrior. The shaman gave you the customary upgrades, I assume. He's fast to pass on my work as his reward. Use them well. The Lord High Researcher for Clan Erdnot has no time to make replacements. But perhaps I can offer a discount. Uh, you have an impressive title there. I take it you're a scientist. <laughs> I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. You killed your predecessor? Not exactly what I would call effective academic theory. <laughs> I don't care what you call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. So what are you researching? You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best offensive ordinance yet. A real ground pound. What are you doing now, though? The new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines <laughs> and agriculture? Yeah, yeah. What else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. <laughs> uh, what do you think of Rex? It sounds like the new clan leader has some very different ideas on how to lead the Krogan. If you want to know more, talk to him directly. He's my leader. I'll not say anything else about it. Hmm. Okay. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. Let's have a look at the database. Oh, we can buy things. Shotgun damage. We do have the money for that. And the last is like and when I didn't get what something from uh, Omega, I got told off. So yes. Let's do this. I mean, yeah, Rex, Jack, Tally, Jacob. That's four people off the top of me how to use shotguns. So it might be worth upgrading. Boop. This is valuable. Um That did cost us a bit. So I'll leave the other ones, I think. Right, I think we've done everything. Don't touch anything. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Wrong step, I, I'm starting to see that uh, uh, when people said money's tight in this game, and I, I was like, "Oh, I've got loads of money. The money won't be tight." I, I, looking at it, it's like, 
Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now I get it. Yeah, money's tight. <laughs> I now get that money is tight. Welcome, Erd Not Grunt. My name is Ratch. You and your Krant will find many items of interest in my store. The human is my battle master. Of course. There's not much here for humans, but you can take a look if you want. Oh, uh, what do you sell here then? What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Ring calls a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. Okay. He's not joking. Ring call hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal. Which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. Uh, tell me about the pie jacks. What the hell is a pie jack? Off-world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. I did. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. <laughs> this sounds like a turret defense type thingy. It could help, I guess. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the pie jacks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the pie jack population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. Okay. No hate for an alien? Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are inert not. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credit than people <laughs> here do. A pragmatist. I should go. Suit yourself. All right. Heavy weapon ammo. Ammo. So increases shields and it <laughs> increases negotiation by ten percent. Not really sure I want any of those, but that's probably going to get us a little bit of experience. So it might be worth doing. One of the children, probably five years from the right. Yeah, my eyes. I think you actually had a fertile female on one of your trips to their camp. One more win in the pits, and done. Let's have a go. Let's see what the human can do. Okay. Okay. Uh. All right. Oh, this is oh, this is keyboard moved. Oh, I just got that one. I'm guessing you, you want to stop them getting all the way down. I thought this would be more turret focused than this way. Oh, no! Ah, oh, boo! I press space. Hmm. Wait, a wave? Waves? Oh, dear. Is it just how long you survive? Direct it. There we go. Come on, come on. Down there. And there. And. Yeah. Wave beginning. How many waves are there? Is it. Or is this. Or is this legitimately just a. See how long you go. Kind of thingy. Ah, oh, boo! Okay. Ah! That's kind of... I'm guessing you're going to have to do that on higher waves. Hit multiples like that. Ah! Oh. Timed that better. I could have hit him. Ah, no! Oh! 
Did not mean to get both of them, but I didn't see them. <laughs> but I'll take the extra shots I can get. Completed Ratchet's quest. Woot. There we go. Turn to the merchant. Place your bed on the pits, you We won't regret it. I think I'll uh, ignore that advice, thank you. You don't want anything I sell, human. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I've got. Uh. I should go. Suit yourself. Can I not tell him that I. Fresh raw project meat is a favorite of Varen everywhere. Okay. Pet the Varen. Good Varen. Let's go. Stay. Oh, you buy the Paget meat to give to the Baron. Seeing those vermin roasting in the heat from an explosive shell. Oh, I swear it was glorious. All right. You were talking discount. I didn't do that for my health. Let's talk payment. You have a lot of skill with those cannons. I'm not going to argue with you. <laughs> I'll give you a discount at my store. Anything you want, you buy at cost. Thanks. I should go. Suit yourself. Yeah, what do we know? Yeah, it's just... Yeah, it's not really... I think we'll keep the, keep the visor. And we'll have a little chat with Rex before we head off. Should I ask the female clan for right of parentage? Why bother with all the policy? You know you've sired a son. That's enough. I can teach him to hunt. The best way is to... Rex! Shepherd. What can I do for you, my friend? Yeah, I'm leaving. You can come with us. Good to see you, Rex. Sure you can't come with us? Wish I could. But I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. Good hunting. Right. Let's head back to the ship, then. And uh, Garrison and Tally want us to talk to them, so we can do that. Uh, we've got those two um, loyalty missions. And of course, we've got recruitment of, what is it, Thane and Samara? Okay, okay. Hide, Morden. Hide! <laughs> right. Glad I didn't bring Garrus then. Let's head back up, shall we? <laughs> the dialogue's still going on. <laughs> Amusing. Refuel regularly if you're on a fuel while exploring. Minerals are depleted to get your ship to a refueling area. That is bad, considering I'm guessing minerals are finite over the entire galaxy. Which, saying it like that, it's probably there's probably more than enough for everything, just in case you do run out of fuel. Actually, I'd, probably, I'd be evil and wouldn't do that. If you want to get everything, you can't do that. Right. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. No. <laughs> Any unread messages? Uh, okay. Uh, where am I up to? Uh, that one. Uh, from Service Intact. Contacting you per elusive man's instructions. He believed you would want to know that he had ordered Project, Subject Zero's project shut down before the riot broke out. Cerberus personnel arrived to find all guards dead, along with most of the subjects. Any surviving children were treated for injuries, given mild am amnesic treatments, and delivered to Alliance facilities as survivors of slave, slave attacks. A few surviving doctors were forcibly retired for their role in the project. Per your report, the facility on Praja has been destroyed. Uh, from Shaman Erdnot. <laughs> Damn it, I hate these things, but you need to hear this. You're part of Grunt's Krant, and you're his leader. So keep him alive. Here, I have to stay polite, play the role. But our people are dying. Grogan have always valued survival over tradition. If you're going to survive as a people, we need to, we need your fat-grown grunt. Okio was a madman, but he was a madman with a plan. And that's more than most of us on this ball of rock. So bring him back from your damn mission. My people need him. And if you all get killed, I'll piss on your graves. 
There's the politics and the politeness, Charmin Erdnot.